Um, just a quick video to show you a Grid Connect solar system on a hot summer's day that you could get installed for your home or business. Uh, it's about 38 degrees. Uh, I'm at my own home at the moment, so I've got the aircon and TVs and everything running. Uh, we'll just go through the output of the inverter. So I can see the output of the inverter getting 4,700 watts or 4.7 kilowatts. And down here on the volts and amps into the grid, 19.2 amps. 245 volts and we've done 20 and a half kilowatt hours for the day just here at our meter box uh you fellow sparkies don't judge me you know your own home is always the worst just go through some of the cables here that's our ac circuit going into the duct of air conditioning then we've got the solar coming in here and then we just over here we've got the back of the meter link so we're just toggling the three phase mains and do the amps that we're getting from the grid. And then we'll turn the solar off and see what happens to the amounts we're getting from the grid. So our main load today is going to be the air conditioning because it's such a warm day. So I'll put the tong meter out. You can see we've got 18.8 amps getting used by the air conditioner. And 18.9 getting produced by the solar. So at the moment, solar is basically supplying all the energy requirements of the air conditioner. So if we come over here to the meter links, which is the cables from the street. Point one on one phase. Point two on another. And 6.7. And I just turn the solar inverter off and now the usage from the grid just goes up to 21 so yeah so that solar power system is basically looking after the full load current of the air conditioning on the hottest day of the year uh, so you could see how our solar power system could help out your home and business provided you got something to use that power as you're producing it from your solar power system there's also storage options available i think everyone's got a man crush on the Tesla at the moment and Elon Musk including myself but uh, the reality is uh, if you've got the load profile for it, swimming pool, air conditioning or you're using that load during a day like a business you don't need a hell of a lot of storage to get a great financial result from a solar power system. Thanks very much. See ya.